Hey friends, Steve Guttenberg here and I am the Audiophiliac. I have a riddle for you. Riddle me this. So you're walking down the street, you hear the sound of a piano out of a window, of an apartment window on the fourth floor. You hear that sound and you go, that's a real piano. Or your, your same example, you're walking down the street and you hear a voice, an opera singer. You go, that's an actual uh, sing a singer, not a recording of a singer, or a, somebody's practicing drums. You can tell, bam, right away, that's a real drum kit. Why is it so easy to tell? What's going on there? In other words, it has nothing to do with frequency response. It has nothing to do with dynamic range or stereo imaging or any of the usual suspects that we use to say, this sounds good, this sounds real. But we know when it's real. Um, I've asked a number of uh, speaker designers and other people in the audio business this, this question, and no one has ever really come up with a satisfying answer. I guess the best they ever come up with is dynamic range, that you can hear the dynamics even over the window. I, I don't, I'm not sure I, I accept that. And here's another example of the same way of stating the same question. So, uh, I'm in a recording studio, this really happened, and um, it's before the session starts, so there's a piano there and it's being tuned. So I'm on the phone talking to a friend and I said, I wonder if you can tell the difference between when I'm in the control room and the sound of the piano is coming out over the monitor speakers or I'm actually in the studio and you can hear the, the piano. So I walk back and forth <coughs> between the uh, studio and uh, the control room and he had no hesitation. He knew exactly which was which. He, he, he knew. He could, it was very easy for him to tell. So again, we're, he, he's hearing this over the lowest possible fidelity uh, device, a telephone, and yet he knew. So what is it? What is it about the sound of a real music that's a real, real, real music, real, a real instrument that's so easy to tell over the window example or over uh, a, a phone that it cues right in and we know the difference? So uh, if you have any ideas, if you have a better answer than I've given, Please uh, leave it in the comment section below. Uh, please uh, share these videos if you like my stuff. Please subscribe to this YouTube channel. And um, come back tomorrow because there'll be another new video. There's one almost every day. Anyway, thanks for watching. Bye-bye.